everything in my classroom is orange and blue. I, I wear orange and blue to school every day, and I have uh, my orange and blue sneakers that at the end of each year gets uh, retired, and I hang them up on the wall. Keith Robinson is a seventh grade teacher in Harlem, New York, and is a University of Florida graduate. He bleeds orange and blue. He is using his enthusiasm for the Gators as his next lesson plan on this field trip to UF. These kids are here um, first and foremost to try and get them um, excited about and interested in attending college. To see the rewards of a college education, these 7th and 9th graders from Harlem's IS-195 are about to get a lesson in health care. Guys straight ahead, girls to the right. So it was time to put on some scrubs. These are going to pull over your shoes, okay? And booties. Then it was off to the operating room for some fun with Dr. David Paulus. Who needs an operation? Me. That's what I was afraid of. Whoa. So who would be a good volunteer? Me. Or your teacher. teacher. No. The students learned how to start an IV and give a patient oxygen. That's probably enough. But the most fun came with squirting their teacher with gel and using ultrasound to see underneath his skin. Next stop, the emergency department with Dr. Adrian Tyndall. Okay, you know why we wear lead here? Any idea? Anyone knows? We do lots of x-rays. It was then time to go to the roof and visit the helipad. And then you were able to get the patient out of the helicopter, bring them down into the elevator. Yeah, it's cool. The last stop on the hospital tour was with College of Medicine Dean Dr. Michael Good. I think we have 60 different kinds of doctors here at the University of Florida. Since coming on the field trip, these 20 school kids from Harlem now understand teacher Keith Robinson's passion for the University of Florida. At first we thought he, he was kind of crazy because he had gators like this is the swamp, orange and blue everywhere. But then yeah, we, we learned about the gators and we learned he's not crazy anymore. Keith Robinson collected $20,000 by various ways of fundraising to pay for the field trip. He hopes one day to see one of these students at UF, but... More importantly, if they go to a college or a university and graduate, that would be, you know, the bigger, bigger deal for me, whether it's University of Florida or somewhere else. At the University of Florida, I'm Chris Bilowich.